I'm not really very interested in just imparting knowledge. I think that that's, in a way, that's quite selfish. I'd much rather consider that people who've listened and people who've attended have taken away a nugget which will transform how they garden. And that's what I enjoy doing. That's, that's the basis, really, of, of the all communication that I try and put across. It's telling gardeners why they do what they do and how plants behave, how plants respond. You can't really feel how warm and friendly he is um, when you hear him on the radio or, or see him on telly. I don't think that comes over so well, but when you see him like this, he's just so approachable and lovely. Instead of learning about you know, pruning of lavender, why not learn about what the plant is doing and how the plant behaves to pruning generally? And then you can take that information and immediately it becomes enabling. So rather than becoming just a very specific, practical instruction, you feel liberated, you feel empowered, you feel as though you can go to your garden and know exactly why you're doing what you're doing. I think, I think that was the thing I got most out of it. The, the facts were very interesting and his approach is very interesting. Um, but it's the idea of how do we create paradise now on earth, really. Only by being true to yourself and your aims and ambitions will you ever deliver a garden which is truly individual, and I think that's what we all strive for.